to the highlight of HBL PSL 7, match number two. It's the Quetta Gladiators against the Peshawar Zalmi coming to you from the National Stadium in Karachi. A look at the pitch, a dry one, an expectation that the pitch would be a bit on the slow side, but should be a good one for both sides. In terms of the toss, it was the Peshawar Zalmi that called correctly, and they decided that they would field first. We'll look at the two sides then for confirmation. A few big names on show, despite the Zalmi particularly having to go into their reserves. A look at the Quetta Gladiators, Will Smead, a youngster, Ben Duckett experienced, and James Faulkner, the third of the overseas pros, a side that is full of good players. Now, time to get to the action. Here we go then. Half a shout, angled towards that leg side, the uh, off and its leg buys that get the Quetta Gladiators started. Smeed smears it through the offside. Lovely that for four. Leg side and picked off. It's four to finish the over. A good start for Quetta. Ten without loss. Shot. Ah, oh, beautifully done. Strays in length and line and is dispatched for six. Frustrated with himself, trying to bowl a similar ball to the ball before. Same length, different line, and just helped on its way. Looks in good touch. He's not going to miss out. A little bit of extra pace to work with. Man, oh, he's coming too far. A total misjudgment. Shot. Oh, that's a beauty. Saw it early, latched onto it. Four to finish. It's 42 without loss. See if he gets a little bit of turn. It's gone underneath that, it's gone straight, has it gone all the way? No, it hasn't. It's on the bounce, but it has gone for four. Gotcha. Underneath that and lost it, has that gone all the way? It certainly has. That is a beauty. What a good shot that is. That's a big over as well. 14 runs from it, six gone, 62 for none. Strong drive, and a through, that's gone for four. That, I guess, should have been stopped. Uh, no guess what he needed. Go Top edge, opportunity now. Oh, and it's grassed. It's grassed, can you believe that? Did all the hard yards and then dropped it. Should have been taken, really. No excuses then. Could have been the first wicket for Osman. Pitched it up. It was the conventional leg spinner, got it to spin. Will Smead going for the sweep, top edged it. Oh, that's a costly miss. Yeah, that's a sitter. He's picked that up, and he's picked that up superbly. That has been hit a long, long way. My goodness, he gives it something, this boy. What a great shot, six to finish the over, a dozen from it, 87 for none. He's picked that wrong one, and he's gone with it. Hard yards out on the boundary, didn't quite get there. In the end, it was just the one, though, so that's really good fielding from Rutherford. Well, that's where he's been so strong all the way through this innings, and it sails over the ropes yet again for Will Smead. 50 for him. And he's made it in very good time as well. 
impressive. Yes, got the opportunities, but he made sure that he put them away like he's done here after picking the slowy and dispatching it. Catch! Well, that's well struck. That is beautifully struck. Over the head of Long on by some distance. And both opening batsmen now up to the 50 mark. Asanali 50 exactly from 33. They have complemented each other absolutely beautifully. Now that's the highest ever opening partnership too for Quetta Gladiators in the history of PSL. So a fantastic start to this tournament for them. Well, that's found the gap. It hasn't added another 20,000 rupees to the tally, but it's certainly added four runs. 123, still without loss. This could be out. Uh, well, it could have been out. Imam Olhak. Too good. I don't know how to describe the fielding. There's been a few dollies that have been dropped. Well, as boundary catches go. That's clever. Yes, it's a risk, but it's mighty clever. <laughs> oh, that's lofted, and it's going to clear the ropes at wide long off as well so a beautiful shot for four all along the ground followed by this one lifted over the ropes for six we're getting close to carnage absolutely brilliant the problem with the slowy there is its length is not quite right but the line too and it allows Esanelli to free the arms it can just have a, an almighty swing makes the connection as well and off it sails. Up she goes, over she goes. Just another six more, another 20,000 rupees in the kitty. 155 without loss. <laughs> oh, well. Well, 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 may be checked. I'm sure it will be checked. Yes, thank you. I'm satisfied. It's a fair catch and uh, my decision is out. Big screen out. Well, don't drop this one. And they've dropped three, I think maybe four, but uh, that probably one of the easier ones, and it's not going to be for Ben Duckett. Ben Duckett had to get on with it straight away. It's a shot he plays pretty well. Samin Gul taking a very good catch, running back. Ben Duckett top edging that one, running back, never easy over your shoulder. Kept his eyes on the ball and taken very well after missing about three and a half chances he walks back for a duck quite now one five six for two should be taken surely yeah they're not going to drop that pat brown he put one well technically probably didn't even put the previous one down That's going to go for four. Forget uh, Will Smead and any uh, individual achievements. They still need boundaries. They're getting them. Oh. 
It's gone. Has he got enough of it? No, he hasn't. Is there a mix up? No, there isn't. They might just check again. Maybe an issue on height as well. It's all happening out there. As it were, it counts as Pat Brown down there. He's been busy in the outfield. He did uh, just uh, have a bit of a, a fist pump with his teammate just after this. Yeah, it's fine. But the end of a magnificent knock from Smee, that was simply amazing. Yeah, absolute stunner. Star was born a while ago, but it's shining bright now. Will Smead there, 97. A look at the batting card. The Quetta Gladiators are asked to bat first. And wow, what an innings that was from Will Smead. 97 from 62. A great opening partnership as well with Asan Ali. 73 from 46 for him. They ended 190 for four. As far as the bowling is concerned, well, not too much to speak of. Samin with two for 41 and two for Kadir as well for 20 in his four overs. So the target, 191 for the Zalmi to get. He starts us off. Nicely played. Just a little punch off the back foot, and it's a fast outfield. Oh, dear. Trailing arm as he is balancing himself with the slide there, Smeet. Shot. Beautifully played. And away for four. This is a nice start for Yasir Khan. He'll get that away as well. A couple of full tosses. And a shake of the head. Not going according to plan for him. At 16 without loss. Free hit. Gone for four. Working nicely here for the Zalmi. Oh, beauty. That is some shot for six. Just fantastic. Using his feet down the pitch. No respect for the experienced fast bowler. Watch that. Straight to the man. Oh, the idea was okay, you know, but couldn't quite execute, couldn't get under it. And Yasser Khan has got to go. The experienced Nawaz pitching it right up there. He wanted to go up. He wanted to have a little bit more of elevation. Couldn't really get it. Hard down the ground. That's four more runs. Good use of the feet. Smack that for another boundary. Big pressure on Nawaz now. Oh, that's a bit of a slice. Should be out. Is out. Easily taken. Hasnain hovering underneath that one. That is an important wicket. He was just looking to slam all over the place, and now he's gone. Clever bowling, though, wasn't he? Just held it back a little bit. He was brave as well. He stuck it up in above the eye line. He said, I know I've been clattered, but you know what? You're going to have to do it one more time. And he couldn't quite manage it. Not the middle of the bat. It was the leading edge, I think, or the outside edge and a simple catch. Oh, the cab more 22 from 16, 62 for two. A lot of people are going to be thinking about what's happening right now. That's stunned into the ground, but he's got it through. He's found a gap, and that's going to be another boundary. So that's back to back. That mounts the pressure. Ah! He's got a wicket there. That is an important wicket. Nawaz gets the last laugh as a tidy catch from the captain. came at him in the end it wasn't quite there yeah healthy edge that is a brilliant brilliant catch the shower well they're not out of it yet Hyder Ali big wicket 19 from 21 77 for three
Well, that's the sort of shot that is needed to give this chase some impetus. 19th tournament six in this HBL PSL seven. And if you want someone to face spin, it has to be Shoaib Malik. The matchup show that he's devastating against spin. This is his power. This is his strength. That's gone high in the air and it's got the distance. Goes for six. A right man on strike. Lefty to the left arm seam. He's tried to stay out of the arc. He went outside he's off. He's trying to make sure that he's... Goes for it again and this one's gone even further, has it? No, it's just evaded the fielder. Seems to be hanging in the sky. Seemed to be going for six to start with, just seemed to come back a little bit. Drag that length back, he's just maybe floated this up a bit fuller. And he's been clunked leg side. And the wind forecast suggesting that Salmi might have it under control. This has gone straight and long. It has gone the distance yet again. This is where Shoaib Malik is so dangerous against spin. Oh, that's nice. That is very, very deft. James Faulkner offers just the tiniest bit of width outside the off stump. And that little dab just runs it away for four. In the gap. Has gone for four. They needed that. The Zalmi. It's one, five, three for three. Gone for the big one. Hasn't quite got it. Hasn't quite got it. The catch is taken. Iftikhar. It was short. It was a correct shot to play, but didn't quite get it from the middle. And he, he knew the moment he did it, he didn't get quite enough. Bang! Out the park! Show Malik again! He's done it for years and years. He's moosed it. Gone at it again. Oh, show of Malik. What a show he's putting on here. Just the four left to get off the final one. It's 187 for four. Second. Oh, twist. Twist. Could it be? It's Rutherford gone. Wasn't unsure to begin with, but then pushed long on back. And Sherfane Rutherford has hit it straight down the throat of that man on the fence who picks up another catch, Mohammed Nawaz. Holding round the wicket. They'll take it quite comfortably. It's a top chase that. The Zalmi won the toss, decided to field first. And the Gladiators were well on their way to 200 and more. And they managed to keep them down to 190. And then in the chase, lost a few up at the front and managed to keep their heads. A look at the batting card for the Peshawar Zalmi, 191 for five. Some chase that was, 22 up at the top and 30. That set things up. And then the follow-up all the way down as you go, some contributions. But the man who did it really was Shoab Malik, who saw them all the way home, 48 from 32, in a partnership with Talat, 52 from 29. A look at the bowling card and though they got some wickets, probably wickets a little bit late, somewhere in the middle of the game, three for 44, Nawaz did a decent job, but not enough in the end, Faulkner with the wicket, as well as Nassim, one for 19 and was very economical, as I say, not enough, still the Zalmi managed to get over the line. Despite his side not winning the game, he played some innings. What a knock it was from Will Smead.
and was the player of the match in this match number two. A look at the summary then, 190 for four, played 191 for five, a win for the Peshawar Zalmi by five wickets. We hope you enjoyed this highlights. We'll catch you again next time.